Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to fold my little Beethoven portrait. I've designed this model for a world record attempt um, to celebrate Ludwig van Beethoven's 250th birthday and um, as you all know last year 2020 it was not possible to um, to celebrate that well so um, I decided to postpone it and do this celebration for Beethoven's 251st birthday and maybe you want to join to this um, in this record attempt and fold one of these and send me a photo and I will um, I put all the photos on a web page and um, yeah hopefully there will be 2021 at the end of this year I will give you the the link in the video description so here's how to fold this little model it's a very easy one you can fold it from even 10 by 10 squares um, but you can also use this uh, template that I have provided for you and uh, you will find it also on my web page and I will give you the link in the description so all you have to do is just print out and cut out this template um, you have a 15 by 15 centimeter square after that and here's this little image from Beethoven 251st um, birthday and it is connected to our festival Luft und Raum, Luft und Raum. so you here's how to fold it you start with the white side up and then you fold the paper in half. Just fold this over. And then just fold the upper edge to the lower edge. So and unfold and then fold the upper edge to the middle crease by the way I just cut out the hair but um, if you just cut a square then it will look like this I think that's uh, also very nice so then you fold the um, upper edge to the middle crease like so and open then turn around the paper and fold the two diagonals this is number one open and number two and open and then just fold a water bomb base by bringing in these two points fold them down to the middle and flatten the model that's it and then 
fold back the this upper triangle like so on the existing crease on the other side you you see that the face already is in its right place so then you fold this upper corner down to the to the middle of the paper to the center like so and repeat on this side oh the paper moved a bit it's not not that important okay and then fold this tip to the middle line and you want to pay attention that this edge is parallel to this edge and repeat on this side you see and then just tuck this tip under same here And now the next step is a little needs some force because you want to make a crease parallel to this middle line only on this upper layer in the half of this triangle so fold this um, corner to the middle like so but only crease in this this area this is a pre-crease and open and do the same thing on on this side the paper is very thick here so you need some power to fold this over and open and now turn the paper around you see the model is almost done just fold the, the chin under so that you have a nicer shape for the face yeah. and because you want to f to f to um, to have a more elegant shape here. Um, we bring in two curved folds, and that's why we pre-crease this one. Just hold this down, and then make a curve from here to somewhere here. Uh, not necessarily to exactly to the corner like I did now usually I fold it a little further than that and then a curve here okay and the same on this side like so you can use your thumb to bring in a very nice smooth curve and then just make a round shape here to make the model stand like so and that's it your first Beethoven is done
so for the for the world record you can print out these templates or you can you can use just normal copy paper uh, use any size you like and um, the main thing is that you basically use this model and of course send me the photo hope you like this model and you like folding it and in in the next video I will show you some variations that I found for this um, model one is um, that you have a color change for the hair you can um, fold his suit and you can bring the whole um, model 3d by opening this back side and um, yeah I will show you in the next in the next video and I also I'm just working on something that brings m even more of this hair and for this I have to change the base a little bit but um, and, and to bring in a face so that's two variations that I will show you in the next video so as I said I hope you enjoy this model and you, and, and, uh, you enjoy folding it see you next time bye bye